Corona virus. Times are not normal outside and we know that well. The industry and the entire economy has come to a screeching halt, affecting the lives of millions of people around the world. With certain sectors of the industry completely wiped out, employment has also taken a massive, massive hit. Some companies, which we designers always looked up to, had to take really hard calls of letting their awesome people go. Yes, I'm talking about the jobs that people have lost due to this pandemic. If you have been affected, remember this is not like the regular ones where people are asked to leave due to their non-performance. This is different. This can even be possible because maybe you are too good. We all know that being too good comes with a higher price tag, which probably is something your employer doesn't want to spend at the moment. It's like that dream car of yours. It's awesome, it's great, and you know that it's going to add so much of value to your life, just that it's too expensive. Great car, but you can't afford it yet. Maybe your employer cannot afford the awesome you at the moment. Now don't think that this is going to be a motivational talk or something like that. Nah, you don't need that. In this video, I'll help you find the answer to the question, now that this has happened, what can I do next? Stay tuned. Welcome to my channel. This is Sapta and if you're here for the first time, this is the place where I help designers build and scale their career with tips, suggestions and tutorials. So if you're into it, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. They say that 2020 is all about survival. If you survive, you win. Everything else can come back. If you're watching this video, it certainly means that you want to think and plan way beyond only survival. So in this video today, I'm going to talk about what I think you should do if you are seeking for a design job in 2020. It's simple. There are only two ways. In fact, there are only two ways for anyone who's seeking any kind of job in the world today, be it design or non-design. My friends, the first way is to wait. Wait for the situation to subside. If you already have a job and you're looking to switch to something better, hold on to it for the time being. And if you do not have a job in hand, then wait for some more time. When I say wait, I don't mean wait watching movies and playing games all day long. I mean waiting while doubling down on your skills. Sharpen the skills that you already have and learn new skills. Skills that pay your bills. If you want to know more about which skill you should pick up, check out my video on salary negotiation where I have spoken in detail about how you can shoot up your value as a designer by working on your skills. I'll leave a link in the description so that you can check that out. This is also a good time to revisit your portfolio and upgrade it. If you are a beginner, consider working on a new pet project or make an existing project better by adding more details and X factor to your portfolio. Don't know what X factor in portfolio means? Let me know in the comment section if you want me to make a video on design portfolios. There's a famous saying from the movie Batman Begins which says, it's not what you're underneath, it's what you do that defines you. Likewise, it doesn't matter where you're employed. Job is temporary and it cannot and shouldn't define who you are. It's what you do defines you. And my friends, this is the time to do. Work your fingers to the bone and emerge at least 2x better than what you are today so that you become a proposition too good to say no to. Years later, when you look at this phase, it may seem like a pause. A pause where the entire world was hibernating. But not you. When everyone was hibernating, you went ahead and utilized the time in a way that puts you at an advantage over everyone else. Think of this as a vesting period. The way you invest your time will determine the benefits that you will reap once this period is over. And trust me when I say this, this period will come to an end. Well, we may not reach a stage where things are exactly the way it was before, but we will certainly reach a stage where things are at least 80% the way it was before. And the remaining 20%? Well, you never know, it may even make things better. For example, with the whole world getting used to working from home, Remote working can be the new normal. And if that happens, you may even get a chance to work for some of your dream companies 
anywhere in the world, which could have been difficult in the past due to visa and permit issues. So stay positive. The second way is to start looking for jobs right away. Yes, most of the companies are not hiring, but there are still many companies which are functioning just like the way before. Any company that is into online streaming services might be hiring. E-commerce companies might be hiring. Cloud services, digital tools, online meet, or rather any company which is even somewhat immune to this entire pandemic might be hiring. One good way to know is to look at your own life. What are the products and the services that you're still using in spite of this lockdown? There's a good chance that those companies or companies similar to them are still hiring. Check out the career section of their websites. Look for postings on LinkedIn. Connect with the people who are working for those companies and find out if there are any chances of you finding a job there. In short, keep trying. I would also highly recommend you list yourself on adplist.org. ADP stands for Amazing Design People. And as the name suggests, it's a list of all the amazing people from the design industry all over the world who are looking for jobs. You can list yourself on the platform by filling a simple Google form with your personal details like name, design function, link to your portfolio, email ID, and a few other details. It takes less than two minutes to fill this out. Alternately, you may even browse design jobs that are already posted on the platform. They have a list of all the design openings from companies all around the world that are still hiring. You can filter by your location or search for a preferred job or title. You can read through the description and also directly apply for the job right there. So yes, you have the access to the information of all the companies that are hiring for design roles right in front of you. Awesome, isn't it? But all these listings, openings and awesomeness still cannot guarantee that you will land into a job. In fact, nothing ever can guarantee it. It depends on a lot of things, from your competency to the needs of the company and at times even sheer luck. But what ADP List can certainly guarantee you is a mentor. You just need to click on Get a Portfolio Review to see a list of all the mentors from all over the world. You can filter by location or search for a name or a title right away. Guess what? I'm a mentor too. You can directly schedule a one-on-one -on -one conversation by finding an available slot that suits you. Once you do this, the request gets confirmed and a calendar invite is created. During the call, you can ask for their advice, suggestion or even a review of your portfolio. The time is yours, however you choose to utilize it with them. Remember, these are some of the most well-known people in the industry from around the world and now it is possible not just to reach out with them but also have a one-on-one -on -one conversation directly because they have volunteered to be mentors. Nope, I'm not getting paid to speak about ADP List. I genuinely believe that this is a great platform and a need of this hour. All the things that I've mentioned so far are available to everyone at free of cost, obviously. This platform is built by my friend Felix and his team and now it is also supported officially by Envision so you can imagine its scale. So, this situation is a crisis, a big one, but I'm pretty confident we shall overcome. Coronavirus is not going to wipe out the human race. Coronavirus is not going to kill you. But you know what might? The regret of not utilizing this opportunity. Damn, I had so much time back then. I wish I had done something. Let this regret not haunt you all your life. Let's do something great while we still can. Let me know in the comment section one new thing that you have learned during this lockdown. If you like this video, like, share, subscribe and don't forget to hit the bell icon so that you get notified every time I upload a new video. If you want me to make a video on anything particular, let me know below in the comments so that I can get back to you there. This is Sapta. See you guys in the next one.